Just a comment in on YouTube, uh, and I'll just put it to you, Richie. Uh, Yera stop on YouTube. He just said, from Cody's point of view, it boils down to treachery with all those uh, letters, those eight letters, all in capital letters. Um, do you do you think that is even reflective of an, an opinion in Kilkenny that there's a bit of treachery or betrayal or like it's... Will you probably say absolutely. it's not that... Yeah. Absolutely, absolutely not. Do you know, because look, at the end of the day... Henry managed the Ballet Shamrocks to two club All Irelands. I don't know was he approached by Brian or not. I don't know to get involved with the senior setup. Quite likely he was. Was he approached maybe to take on a minor an under twenty an under twenty team in Kilkenny? You know to kind of get that experience at inter county level to then maybe step into you know the senior role when Brian steps away. But Henry's next move was was inter county hurling. You know there's no doubt about that. And the Kilkenny job wasn't up for grabs. I'm sure that's the one Henry probably had would like to get. So, yeah, you know, a big hurling county like Galway comes knocking and you're telling me he's going to, you know, turn it down or refuse it because he might come up against Kilkenny someday. I don't think that's the way manage, management works. Um, you know, so treachery, I no, absolutely not. Um, I, I sent Henry a text message after he was announced and I wished him the very best of luck. Um you know, because obviously it was the next step for him after his success with Ballet and Shamrock. So I, I still firmly believe that, you know, Galway's gain is unfortunately Kilkenny's loss. Um, but, you know, you just have to get on with it. What was your own read on it, Kieran? Yeah, I, I suppose I felt sad, actually, when I saw it. 